Hurricane Michael has interrupted fall break for some people as a vacation on the Gulf Coast. At the same time, people are filling up on gas, buying water and food in case the power goes out. Our Cody Long is live in Pensacola Beach tonight. He's been talking to people there, locals and vacationers alike. Cody? Yeah, the wind really picked up here today along the beaches, and people behind me are getting gas. They are filling up their tanks. Just about an hour ago, there were lines here at this gas station to, at these pumps. Everyone trying to fill up their tanks before it's too late. We're going to go get gas right now just in case we got to get out of here. Kyle Mallory and his family might be waiting in line to get that gas. They're here at Pensacola Beach from Tennessee until Friday. He and his wife Julia are teachers on fall break and they aren't letting Hurricane Michael ruin their plans. We are here at a reservations book, so we were coming. We're just hoping that it's not what's going to hit us directly. The surf is rough. Many people just enjoying looking at it as the sun set tonight. It's amazing. Super hot. It's a super high wind, too. Have you ever seen anything like this? Uh, no. Jason McDonald and Diana Bookhart are preparing for the worst and hoping for the best. Just making sure I have food that I don't have to cook and um, making sure there's plenty of water and ice and all that kind of stuff. And many people will be out tomorrow getting free sand to stack around their homes. We have a list of the locations across northwest Florida on our website, WKRG.com. Reporting live in Pensacola Beach, I'm Cody Long, WKRG News 5. Thanks, Cody.